Every person born in 1999 is in a race to be the last human alive born in the 20th century. Doesn't have to be from 1999. All of them could die and it could be someone from 98. Just saying. Damn I was born December 99 so I had an advantage but I smoked so many cheap dabs. I feel like 80 would be lucky. Theoretically it could be someone earlier, if all the people born in 1999 die prior to an arbitrary person born before. Technically, it should be every person born in 2000. 2000 is still 20th century. Technically 21st started in 2001 so you can't exclude people born in 2000. Am I right? The look on their faces when this gal from 1998 outlives them all. I'll bury all of them and I'm from 1979. Plus you forgot people of 2000, which is the 20th too. The year 2000 is still part of the 20th century, the 21st century started with 2001. Could also be the last person born in 2000 since that's the last year of the 20th century. The century ran from January 1, 1901 to December 31, 2000. 2001 was the first year of the 21st century. Sorry to ruin your fun, but the last year of 20th century is 2000. People born in 2000 have an advantage seeing that they are the last year of the 20th century. But they were all of them deceived, for another birth year was included. I believe that technically, the 20th century started 1901 and ended 2000. Because we don't have a year zero, only 1 BC aka 1 and 1 AD aka 1. Otherwise the first century would have been only 99 years, and I will not accept that. I was working as a midwife 31 12 99 and everyone was trying to hold off for midnight. I managed to deliver the last baby for 1999 and the first one for 2000 for our hospital. As pedantic as it is, the 20th century actually ended in 2000. 2001 was the first year of the 21st century. If they could take their time getting there, I'd appreciate it. I was born just in the 2000s, so in order to be the last person alive born in the 21st century I'd need to live to be about 115 so we still have enough people left when I'm done. Then order a mass execution that puts the holocaust to shame. I am sure someone has already pointed this out, but you are wrong. The year 2000 was not the new millennium or new century. Actually, centuries start on 01 not 00. So the last day of the 20th century is the 31st of December 2000. The year 2000 was the culmination of the 20th century 20 by 100, you know? January 1, 2001 was the beginning of the 21st century. Ah yes, humans lives exactly the same amount, we just drop dead on the same year. What of you from 1998 and nobody from 1999 gets as old as you will? I was in the year of the dragon. 1988. I'm coming for you all. Except everyone born in 1999 could die before a person born in 1998 dies. Or even 1996. Or 1993. I have nieces born in each of those years, and I'm rooting for all three of them to simultaneously be the last people born in the 20th century who are still living. Then 15 meteors come to instantaneously destroy Earth. It could be anyone born 95 to 99 never know how long someone can live but yeah I've thought about that too. Well I was born on December 31st so I think I have an advantage here. Are those the ones that ate Tide Pods? Because if so, I feel like the 1998ers have a pretty good shot at this. I was born in late December 1999. I feel like I've got a good shot. In the end it could end up being someone born in 1998 or 1997. Just saying. TBH, it would look pretty cool to have STH like 1999 2100 written on my headstone. But do I really want to live that long? Not really. 
anyone born from 1985-1999 is. It's easy to imagine that everyone 1999 dies and someone from 1998 wins, and it's harder but still plausible that someone from 1985 could win. My son was born in December 1999 and I always tell him he needs to make it to 102 weeks old so he can have three centuries on his tombstone. I was born in 1967 and I'm still currently in this race. Do not count me out. Yet. The year 2000 is part of the 20th century because the calendar started with the year 1, not 0. The squabbling begin. But what about people born in 2000? They were also born in the 20th century. March 2000 baby here. Still born in the 20th century. I see this mistake all the time, and it annoys me every single time. It is universally accepted that the concept of a year zero is inconsistent with any and all calendar systems. This in turn means that all decades centuries millennia must, by definition, begin on a year whose last digit is a one, or the very first such positive integer period would run one year shorter than all the others. Who was the last standing from the 20th century? How old were they? I could Google, but I won't. Was born in 99 you have no competition from me though I'm dumb AF I ain't lasting that long face with tears of joy. I'm a 97er with a different mission. I just want to live to see the 1st of January 2100 foot. Wouldn't it be cooler to be the last person alive born in the 1000th millennium? I began working out and cleaning up my diet for this exact reason. I was born in 1999 and all of my grandparents lived past 85. My parents are in their 60s and still work full time. I got the genes. Barring something stupid I do to get myself killed, I'd bet on myself. Know that I necessarily would want to live to be 100 if my body is too decrepit. This just isn't true. There is a not insignificant chance that everyone born in 1999 dies before everyone born in 1998. For all we know, the oldest person left alive in 2100 could have been born in 1990 and just lived a really long time. Implying at least two people born in 1999 don't end up achieving biological digital immortality. Now 90 here those 99 ers will vape away into dust and I'll be the last one standing s. Funny this reminds me of my best friend who was born on the last day of the 80s and when he'd call himself a 80s baby I'd be mf only by like an afternoon. This is so not true most of them asked to die every single day source I have a 1999 born child. Yes it's said as a joke. The way these people stare at their phones as they cross the street, or drive down the highway, I don't think most of them are trying to compete. You don't have to be born in 1999. You could be born in 1990, but outlive e erroneously else by 11 years. I was born in 86 and I'm not letting 99 motherfuckers win this. Technically it's the people born in 2000. The 21st century started in 2001 foot. Every human born in 2000 actually. They didn't start counting with year zero. They started with year one. I am born in 1983 and I will beat all you suckers to it ha ha ha. The last person alive to be born in the 20th century has already been born. Just saying. Hell I was born in 87. I'm still gunning for that title. Although the Burger King and beer I had for lunch isn't doing me any favors getting there. Either a race for the last or the firstborn of the century, just not the same one. In a race, you want to be the first. What do you call a competition where you want to be the last? It'll probably just be someone born 1998 to spit on everyone else p. I'm from 1990, but I am just a severed head in a jar. Do the requirements say I have to be a whole person? 